1904, the city um, council approved $15,000 for the formation of, or for improvement of the fire department. At that time, the city council awarded contracts for two new fire stations, uh, one which is over here on J Street and another up on California and Wabash. And the cost of those two stations was $1,295. The council also approved the purchase of fire hose, hose carts, nozzles, uh, fire alarm system, and this steam fire apparatus. It arrived in January of 1905 and it passed its acceptance test a month later in February. And it was in service and pumped at its last fire at the Occidental Mill in 1935. In 1976, as a uh, bicentennial project, the Eureka Firefighters Local 652 took on restoration of the steam engine and brought it up to the shape that you see it in today. Even in 1905, this fire engine cost $6,375 to purchase, which was um, quite a bit of money back then. It's interesting, the acceptance test that you talked about. The acceptance test, the engine had to be able to pump a stream of water over the top of the tower on the city hall. City hall? Yeah. <laughs>
at the 50 psi nozzle, they can easily do 100 pounds. This, I think, if you rated it, capacity is. Uh, I think it can easily do what our modern day engines can do.